Hi everyone, my name is Gary and I'm from Tasty Food Pixels, a brand that is run by Tasty Culture Bites. At Tasty Food Pixels, we do digital marketing for restaurants in Sydney. These restaurants are commonly small Asian restaurants, uh, maybe Chinese restaurants, Japanese restaurants, and the purpose of these videos is really just to share my experience, hoping that my tips can help restaurant managers and restaurant staff uh, grow their relationship with the customers that come into their restaurant. The core purpose behind Tasty Food Pixels is to introduce the diversity to local Australians and to show them that Chinese food is not just about sweet and sour pork, fried rice or barbecue pork buns, there are so many more dishes. To, to be able to show the diversity of these dishes, I think the restaurant has to provide um, really good customer service for their staff to be able to communicate well, to communicate in a friendly way to customers so that customers feel uh, comfortable to try something beyond their comfort zone. But to be able to grow their relationship with customers uh, enough so that the restaurants can introduce different types of dishes. Um, I think the restaurant needs to have some friendly service and its staff, its managers uh, should be able to make customers feel comfortable enough uh, to introduce like, hey, uh, have you tried chicken feet before? Have you tried tripe before? Have you tried beef tendons before? And my own experience having been to these little Asian restaurants my whole life, uh, that it's focused on practicality. Um, with these little Chinese Asian restaurants, you pay the money, you walk in, you eat the food, and then you walk out. When the staff serve you, they just put the dish on your table. There is not much of, oh, how are things going? How was your day? Uh, what? Would you like to eat today? Uh, how can I help you? I think that that's really important, especially if you're trying to grow your, your restaurant in Sydney. Um, Australians really value a conversation and really value not just visiting the restaurant for the food, but also for the interaction with the staff, also to experience the, the vibe of the restaurant. So I hope to share a lot more of these tips in the following videos.